Hey, what's going on? I am here in Brooklyn. About to get some stuff done, but let me talk about this a little. This whole Rondo versus Chris Paul. I listened to Carcino. I don't really like that guy very much. I don't know what he has against LeBron James, but he really hates that guy. But anyway, he's blaming LeBron James. He always finds a way to blame LeBron James for everything. So he's blaming LeBron James for what happened between Chris Paul and Rondo. And I say no. I say bullshit. Now, Chris Paul and Rondo don't like each other. They've had issues before when Chris Paul used to play with um, down there in Louisiana. I forget the name of that team. When, when he used to play with David West down there in Louisiana. You're, you guys know that team, right? And at the time, Rondo was playing with the Celtics. I remember they had a, some little scuffle, whatnot. So already they didn't like each other, okay? How can you blame LeBron James for that? That's number one. Number two, I blame James Harden for that. Not LeBron James, but James Harden. And I blame the NBA and these refs. And I'll tell you why. Um, the guy's name is Ingram. Ingram shoved James Harden. I would have gotten upset too. Maybe I would not have shoved James Harden, but I would be pissed at the officials. And the reason why is because James Harden flops too much, and he's been getting away with it. As far as I'm concerned, James Harden is really not that. He's a good player. But they hype him up too much. I don't think he's that good as people let him seem to be. But my issue with James Harden is that he flops too much. It's annoying. He's always flopping. Always getting away with um, certain calls. How can you create contact? What the, what the fuck is that? He created the contact. He created the foul. What are you talking about? That sounds manipulative to me. He flops. He flops all the time. And Ingram was just upset. If you've been playing in the NBA, always playing with this guy or playing against this guy, and he's continuously flopping, flopping, faking a foul, getting and ones and, 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 um, and foul calls, and then you have to pay the penalty because you, get, you have five fouls before you're ejected. Or not ejected, but you have to sit down. You're fouled out. And this guy is flopping and then you're getting calls, foul calls on you. Of course, you would be pissed. I would be pissed. It's not LeBron's fault. It's the NBA's fault. They're making the team so, so bitchy, so, so weak. All these soft guys playing in the NBA. Why? They call a foul for everything. That's what led to the fight with, with um, Rondo and Chris Paul, even though they didn't like each other. But these refs need to stop calling fouls for James Harden because he is lying. He's flopping. Come on, man. I don't like watching the Rockets play. I like to watch Chris Paul play. I don't like watching the Rockets because of James Harden. He's a crybaby. I, I really don't like to see that guy play. He flops all the time, throw his beard up in the air to create contact, quote unquote. How do you create contact? I, I, I don't understand this rhetoric. You created the contact. What? Come on, man. The NBA needs to punish James Harden. He's flopping too much. And people need to start calling him out and putting pressure on the NBA to stop that shit. 
it's, it's not cool. It takes away the fun out of the game. Anyway, that's my take on that. I'm out, y'all. Peace.